AITA for not lending my husband my car? Our family does not need a full-size truck. We don't haul anything, we don't camp, and we do not own a trailer. We have no reason to own a $100,000 truck, other than my husband really wanted it. It was in our budget, and he was adamant that it was what he wanted. We have three kids, our oldest is 17, our daughter is 15, and our surprise baby is two. Not planned, but a joy for sure. We never take the baby anywhere in the truck. My husband keeps it pristine. My son has a Jetta that he purchased with help from us and his grandparents. It is a reliable car, but it is not in great shape. I have a Porsche Cayenne that is our family vehicle. The back seat has the usual stains from the baby. That's life. Well, my husband recently got a promotion and has to go downtown twice a week now. He tried driving his truck, but it won't fit in the parking garage at his office. He had to park a block away at a surface lot where hooligans might harm it. He asked if he could use my car on the days he goes into work. I said that would not be a problem, he just had to put the car seat in the truck so I could drive with the baby. Nope. He wanted me to drive our son's car and chauffeur the older kids without touching his truck. I declined his generous offer and told him my car was off limits because I needed it for myself. So now he has had to borrow our son's Jetta because his only other option is public transportation. He could afford to Uber, but he doesn't want to do that either. He says I'm being a jerk for not letting him use my car, but I think he's being unreasonable about his truck. If you liked this video, make sure you hit the like button and comment down below your thoughts. Also don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this.